Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to see about the losses. Uh, there are two types of losses we all know, major and minor losses. So how can we put those losses into the system? We will see. So let's start the video. First, you need to do all usual things. Make the distribution, make the network and then go to the pipe table. In pipe table, you will get the, it has user defined length. Okay. If it is not there, I remove the end. You can create from edit. Uh, you will get user define you need to find user defined length so we will get length has user defined we will add and after user defined length we have to add another column which is checkbox so has it user defined length has user defined length add then you need to click ok you will see there are two columns added first is length user defined and second is has user defined length checkbox okay so uh, first method how can we take losses we are talking about the friction losses we have to increase 10 percent losses so we will increase the length so we have to copy all the length from here and paste it into user defined length so we have all the lengths now we have to increase 10 percent length so go to the global edits and set multiply and multiply by 1.1 which is 10 percent increase length okay we got the 10 percent increase length you can see uh, 1247 and here you will see 1134 okay if you calculate 1134 into 1.1 we will get the same result so after increasing length this length will not be implemented if the checkbox in front of the length is not tick so we are going to tick all the checkboxes we can global edit global edit check so after checkbox the system will consider this length and ignore this scale length it will only show in calculations will not be shown in any um, drawings or other things you will get the same length here it has user defined length 97 but it is showing 88 so this is only to take the 10 percent losses so we can we can use that loss so this is first thing after we can increase 10 percent uh, we can increase 5 percent total demand so how can we increase demand we either increase by manually before putting demand into the network or go simply demand center demand control center you have to click s yes. if you make any changes in demand center it will not be undoed so you have to be careful so same thing we have to multiply the demand 1.05 5 percent losses we are considering okay losses we are added we have to consider only any one of those so we will uncheck the length and compute the system so you will get the same result 
after that this is the second form uh, third form is you can decrease the heisen williams value here you can see the heisen williams for hdp is 45 145 we can decrease it 5% we have to decrease so we just have to multiply these numbers let's say 5% decreasing uh, 0.95 we will multiply by 0.95 so it will decrease by 5% so we will get the number and after that you can compute and get the same result as well these are the three ways you can put the uh, losses after that we have minor losses how we can put minor losses into the system uh, you will get the minor loss in components you will see the losses okay minor losses coefficient you will get the all the losses like 15 degree bend 30 bend 45 degree bend 90 degree bend angle construction expansion pipe entrance t voice everything you need to put you will get here but you can you cannot put these numbers from here you have to go to the pipe table pipe table you will see the minor losses you have to same uh, from add from the edit button minor losses first we go to the this pipe and go this pop-up will show you have to uh, click on new quantity one minor loss you have to choose minor loss what like 90 degree bend if we have another 45 degree bend to 90 degree bends we can control numbers from here it will automatically generate the numbers k factor from here it will multiply how many you put this is the each for one number of bend and this is the total if you suppose T branch so it will take the T branch you put 2 it will calculate as well as 2 we click on ok and we will see the minor loss coefficient has been put into the pipe when we compute this minor loss will be considered in calculation and your network will be optimize by considering this number so that's it for now in next video we will see how to generate user defined component for example the outer dia this outer dia is not part of the system you will not get the uh, outer dia if we open the new pipe table and add diameter you will get only uh, one diameter here which is already in uh, table so this diameter is part of the system uh, outer dia is not part of the system so we will not get the outer dia we have to generate so next video we will see how to generate the additional field thank you if you have any doubts you can contact me through my linkedin account so you just have to click the link given in the description below you can ask me any question or any doubts from there thank you